This video provides an overview of installing the single sign-on and password management components. These components help you configure Identity Manager for single sign-on access and for allowing users to reset their passwords. Identity Manager uses OSP as the authentication service to provide single sign-on access to identity applications and identity reporting. SSPR integrates with the identity applications and OSP for helping users who have access to the identity applications to reset their passwords without administrative intervention. NetIQ bundles OSP and SSPR in the same installation program for your convenience. You can deploy these components on the same server or on different servers. In our example server deployment, OSP is deployed on the server 3 and 4 where you deploy identity applications. SSPR is deployed on this server. This is the workflow to install OSP and SSPR components. Step 1. Install PostgreSQL and Tomcat. You can install them using the wizard or perform a silent installation. Step 2. This is an optional step. Execute this step only if you want to record the events in Tomcat using the Apache Log 4J service. Step 3. Install OSP and SSPR components using the wizard or you can also do a silent installation. After installing these components, install and configure the identity applications to use single sign-on access and password management functionality. To install PostgreSQL and Tomcat using the convenience installer that NetIQ ships with the 4.5 installation package, PostgreSQL is required for user application. In this example, we are selecting to install both the applications. You can install them using the wizard or perform a silent installation. In a wizard installation, select the All option in the Select Install Sets page. In the Tomcat Install folder page, enter the Tomcat port details. In the PostgreSQL details, Provide information such as database name, database admin, password for the admin user, and the PostgreSQL port. In the pre-installation summary page, review your settings and if the settings are correct, begin the installation. Now let us perform a silent installation of these components. Find the silent properties file in this path. Ensure the paths and the IP addresses are specified in the tomcat.install file. Specify the required paths, IP addresses, and netiqdb password in the postgreSQL.configure file. If you are installing on a Linux machine, use this command. For Windows installation, use this command. You can use the log4j property service to track the log events in Tomcat. To use this service, download the Julie files for the Tomcat version 7.0.55. These steps can be found in using Apache Log4j service to log sign-on and password event section in the setup guide. You can install OSP and SSPR using the wizard or perform a silent installation. To install OSP in a wizard installation, select the OSP option in the Select Install Sets page. To install SSPR in a wizard installation, select the SSPR option in the Select Install Sets page. In the Tomcat Connection page, provide the Tomcat server IP address in the hostname field and specify the Tomcat port number. In the authentication details page, provide information such as LDAP host IP address, LDAP port number, and select the Use SSL checkbox. 
specify the path of the JRE Trust Store file and the password for the JRE Trust Store. This information is only required for SSPR installation. While installing only OSP, installer skips these pages. In the SSPR details page, ensure that the SSPR redirect URL is correct. Fill in the details for the other pages until you see the pre-installation page. In the pre-installation summary page, review your settings. If the settings are correct, click install. Now let us perform a silent installation of these components. Find the silent properties file in this path. Edit the OSP SSPR configuration file to specify the paths and IP addresses for your installation. Specify the values for NetIQ auth admin password, NetIQ OSP key store password, NetIQ SSPR config password, the NetIQ SSPR OSP password. Also mention NetIQ SSL key store file and SSL key store password. If you are installing on a Linux machine, use this command. For Windows installation, use this command. Thank you for watching this video. Music